Ah, <laughs> I was gonna scare you. You never How's it going? scare me. Good. I think I'm gonna get them. Are you? Today, yeah. Oh. Man. Did you? Did you? Where are they? She's checking. Like, they don't have them over here anymore. She sold the last pair. Oh man. But I mean, that doesn't really matter. They ordered them in, but she said they just got a new shipment of glasses. So she's like, I'd be shocked if like the style that you're wanting isn't in there. Tessa has contacts inside her eyes right now and before she couldn't see anything like even that sign isn't that exciting though this is like your hair looks so pretty today i haven't done it yet <laughs> oh. trying to decide between black and silver i don't know what do you think i don't know um let's see okay that's the silver there's no lenses so this one needs see the black um Hmm, I, I don't know. I'm kind of torn. Like, I think maybe the silver still. <laughs> I don't know. Get your ear. So, Tessa's yeah. new glasses. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Try not to laugh. Now we have to wait an hour for Tessa's glasses to be ready. It's so exciting that she has contacts and you can see stuff. No. Oh my can you read signs? You can see, it's a whole new world. And this is my proper prescription. This is my first time wearing my proper prescription. Oh man. It almost is like everything's over detailed. Oh man. Yeah, you're definitely gonna have to have these for <laughs> Have these for a trip that <laughs> 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 I've been so careful not to say Alright, Tessa's glasses are ready. She bought something nice because she's going to a birthday party tonight. It's like not really fancy though. It's just like it's casual but it's Casual but fancy. It feels super cool. Alright, getting some glasses. Oh, so soft. Let's see how they look. Oh, yeah, it is weird. So I just keep adding. They look straight, yeah. They feel good. They're bent nicely in the back, so we can leave it as is for now. And then when you need them adjusted, just come in and see us. Oh, don't open your eyes. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, do I know you? <laughs> oh, it smells like Subway. Oh, it's really true. It smells like Subway. Tessa just went back to her house because uh, she has to get ready to go to that birthday party tonight. So I'm getting gas and then uh, I gotta go home and start getting ready because I'm going snowboarding tonight with the same people that I went with before. All right, we just got up to Seymour, which is the same mountain as we were at the other day. So it should just be like, you shouldn't have to untie a knot. It should oh, just be slip awesome, knots. Man. Okay. Sweet, thank you so much. You're welcome. You want to need the light for an extra minute? Oh, uh, no, I'm good. I can use it. It's so much warmer up here this time. Last time was like, so yeah, there's so much ice on the ground. It's gonna be like ice age up there. <laughs> see see mammoth. See Sid the sloth. <laughs> ready to go boarding, guys? <laughs> Shit. All right, we gotta go get some tickets. Oh First oh round of the night. Woo. Yeah, 360. <laughs> this is like my binding is like super loose. My board almost fell off. Yeah, the binding totally came undone. All right, so first run, and I just fell. And I think I dislocated my knee. Oh my god, that just sucked so bad. I don't even know what this is gonna feel like trying to snowboard down this mountain. Oh, god, let's check it out. Oh, that felt so weird. Take it easy. All right, so the guys are still going up and down the mountain. Oh, does not feel good right now. Holy crap. It feels like, like it was fine to ride back down the mountain a bit, but now when I'm like sitting here, I don't know how good it is. I'm trying to feel the other one to like see if it's actually still okay. I think it is, like it popped back into place when it dislocated, so. I think it's fine, I just don't know if I'll be able to ride anymore because I don't want it to pop back out again. Oh, awesome. So I went and got it checked out by the first aid guy and he said that it potentially was hyperextended. So definitely not 
gonna be snowboarding anymore because I don't want it to like pop back out or anything. So I'm just gonna go in here and get like coffee or something, just chill out and wait for the other guys to finish. I went into the first aid thing that they have here and they did like a bunch of tests where they like put my knee up and my leg up and they were like pulling my leg and like moving it side to side and feeling my kneecap and like doing a bunch of different tests on it and apparently it's still like pretty strong. If it swells then I have to go to the doctor get to get it checked out. As of right now like it doesn't feel too bad, it just, it just feels like really loose. I'm just chilling, I got coffee and it's actually getting really cold in here. So I'll probably have to turn this on soon. So I'm just waiting for them to finish. I drove Caleb up here, so they're snowboarding right now and I'm just chilling out. So I got home and got dressed because I needed to get out all my snow stuff. And my leg is feeling a little bit weird right now. It kind of feels like it's like still really loose in my like, I don't know. It like doesn't look swollen at all and like nothing seems to be like wrong when you look at it but it just still feels like super, super weird. So it only hurts in one spot when I touch it like on the side, but we'll see how it does. Cause if it's swollen tomorrow, then I'll have to go get it checked out. 